Fox. First at noon, the vaccine rollout in our state is hitting a speed bump as many locations are reporting a shortage of doses. Thank you for joining us, everyone. I'm Kara Sundlin. Eyewitness News reporter Susan Rath is live now in Vernon with the very latest. Susan. Good afternoon. Just minutes ago, the town of Vernon announced that they do have a shortage of COVID vaccines. They say this is just temporary, but right now, because they have run out for vaccines at Rockville General Hospital, they have decided to put the vaccinations on hold. The town administrator and hospital officials said today, again, this is just temporary. And this is something that many hospitals are now experiencing. The problem seems to be that the demand is there, but there is a shortage. In fact, yesterday we spoke to Yukon Health. They ran out of vaccines and had to put appointments on hold, but they got lucky. They got about a thousand vaccines from the National Guard. So at this point, while they wait for more vaccines, they're going to put those vaccinations on hold. We want to make it clear, though, that this does not affect those who made a, an appointment to get a vaccine at the hospital. If you got a vaccine at the hospital, you will get your second one. What this means is that people who may have gotten that first vaccine at another facility or new patients. Now, we did have a chance to speak to the governor earlier today. He did not seem to be too concerned about this. He said that so far the state has given out about 55,000 doses a day. He says that's still pretty good, that we are simply just going through uh, a shortage at this time, and we are a lot better off than we were before. And coming up later on Eyewitness News at 6 and at 5, we will talk to many of the people who are getting vaccines, their concerns, and hopefully when the vaccinations will start. We are live in Vernon, Susan Raff, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.